Hey everyone and welcome to a brand new Let's Play. Today I have for you guys a game that, you know, I've never actually really played much of. And from what I've seen, it's it's a pretty decent game. It's not bad. Could be could have been better if hang on guys, I'm just trying to fix the uh the screen here for us. But for some reason. Okay, first okay, you know what? Hang on guys. Okay, there, there we go, there we go. Don't know why it wants to be frustrating with me. Okay. Anyways, we have Spyro Shadow Legacy. So, anyways, we actually have to click the screen for this. So that's kind of interesting. I always thought that was kind of weird, but sure, we'll click the screen. In a faraway uh, time, there was a land of magic. A young dragon champion of an ancient people slumbered away. The music is a little distorted. It was a time of peace and prosperity, and yet a dark and powerful force gathered its strength. Ah, looks like we're sleeping. Aww. Spyro! Hey Spyro! Come on out! Have you locked yourself in? Oh man, that's funny. Your key must be somewhere in your room. Okay, well I'm going to head downstairs while you figure things out. I do apologize for the music being staticky. That is not my fault. It just, you know, decided to do that. In this game, I don't know, I heard good things about it, but I also heard bad things about it. So, I'm kind of hoping, you know, it's pretty good. And This book is called Along Came Ripto. No, no, no. Uh -uh. I don't want to read it. So anyways, X to unlock. Um, which is the, okay, wait, I was pressing the right button, it was just very slow. Apparently can't unlock that, so I guess we'll just continue on then. Can't charge and jump, which is kind of a bummer, but whatever. Hey Spyro, the fire went out on my stove. Can you breathe on, on it for me? Go ahead pal, I'm gonna head to the docks before I miss my boat. See you there. This is kind of a sequel to A Hero's Tale, but not really, so, yeah. Okay, anyways, let's use our charge. Fire is that, okay, that button. So. Awesome, thanks, pal. I've got a whole bus of tourists coming in for dinner, and I have to get cooking. Okay, that was uh, a weird challenge that seriously meant nothing at all. What's this? Uh, this is titled Surf Report. No. What is this thing? Hmm, doesn't do anything really, I guess. Maybe it's like a waypoint. Hey, sheep. Get back here. Boom! Enemies in the real world drop red butterflies. Eat these for your HP. You can store them in your inventory if you have a jar. Okay. Uh, for sale by owner, 10,000 G. Or 100,000 G. Uh huh. What is that? Hold the R button to charge him, Spyro! Okay. Minus 10. Ah, I got some gems from it, too. Okay, interesting nonetheless. Collect some butterflies and some... Uh, gems, I guess. Hey, what, who are you? 
Laird. Don't these, uh, don't let those stiffy stiffer sons give you a hard time about your studies. Don't let them push you around. Those elders aren't as great as they're cracked up to be. Huh? Remember Red, the evil old dragon? Remember how he tried to destroy this place? Well, Red used to be an elder, Sparrow. So word to the wise, watch your back. Know what I'm saying? Hmm. Yeah, I, I know what you're saying, I guess. Crack it to ya. I did do a Hero's Tale for a bit on my channel. We probably won't get to do it for a while due to the fact that... It's, um... Huh, enter. I won't get to do it because I don't have a PS2 or GameCube, but... Looks like we need um, electric breath for whatever that is, so I guess we can leave. I hope. Can I go in here by chance? Wait, can you? Hmm. I don't know. Don't know how to get out of here. Oh, okay. There's an exit right there. I don't know, there's a lot of those electric pads. I'm assuming we need electric breath or something to get them. Now oh, we also got experience, which is kind of weird, but I'll take it. Okay, apparently that doesn't do anything. The enemies take quite a while to die, though. I'll give them that, but... Remember, I think we're supposed to be looking for, um, Hunter. Hey, who's this? This is Fonsworthy. Well, Spyro, another season over. Time to start your studies. Thomas and the others, uh, other elders are expecting you at the dojo. It most certainly is not dopey. The elders have a lot to teach you. Life isn't all about fun and games, young man. Okay, it looks like we have to go to the dojo and the docks. I don't know if that's two missions or what. Apparently this isn't a super long game, but at the same time it can be pretty long. Well, there's Hunter and looks like Blink. Glad you made it, Sparrow. Have you seen Bianca? Can't leave without her. Can you, uh, can you find her until it's time to go? Bianca wasn't even in uh, the other Spyro games though. Like, she was in two, like, number three, and then in, uh, Enter the Dragonfly. Ah, Mr. Funder. You're a purple dragon, Sparrow. Purple dragons are a rare breed. We expect great things from you. Someday you'll understand what I'm talking about. Vacation can't last forever, you know, even for you. Um, yeah, he actually does bring up a point for another sp series. Ooh, jam. What's this book? Uh, Financial Times. No, 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 no. I don't really feel like reading that. What is this? I really want to know what those are. Is that a gem? There's a gem stuck in the... Can't glide apparently, so I wonder if we can make it up there by chance. Don't think you can, so we'll we'll just leave for right now until maybe we learn how to glide. I'm kinda hoping we learn how to glide. Oh, we can enter this pink one. There's another book on the table here. Uh, this is Two Dragons, One Love. Oh, gosh, no. There's another one of those electric pads. I really, uh, I really wouldn't mind knowing what those are for, but... Apparently we can't glide, so... Maybe we get the ability later. And this is... Who are you? Mrs. Funder. Oh, Spyro, how are you? How sad that another summer is coming to an end! Oh, how I love those summer nights! Oh, okay, you're one of those weird people that has to emphasize certain words when you don't need to. Sure. 
took a lot of burning on that plant to destroy it, apparently. Hey, there's Bianca! Oh, man. Can't really tell where I'm going half the time. Oh, there we go. Hey, I was just uh, taking one last look at this place before we leave. I've got this funny feeling like I'm never going to see this place again. Oh, it is time to go. I'll head over to the dock. Meet me there. Okay, Bianca, I'll meet you there. Oh, we got a key for some reason. I wonder what that's for. I really am sorry about the music, guys. I really do apologize. And Oh, what's up here? Residence only. Yeah, I think you actually do get a home and stuff in this, and you actually, you know, do level up and stuff. It's just, it takes a while. This is an RPG Spyro game, which makes it different than others. Okay, and I think it's our house. We got back to the crab. So I think we just have to go back to the ship. I don't even see a dojo here to, you know, go to. I still want to know what those uh, pads are that look like they have a, a lightning bolt on them. But I guess we'll find out uh, later on. I do like to kill these crabs for some money. Don't know what we'll need the money for yet, so better uh, to pick it up than not. Okay, let's pick up this crab before we go. Hey guys, I'm ready to go. Well, that's that. Vacation is officially over. Yeah, but it's time to go. I need to get back to my cousins. They're a mess without me. What a responsible bunny rabbit. Shut up. Whoa. Or what? What, what are you going to do, Spyro, now that we're leaving? You're going to be bored silly without us. Ew, school. You're going to study with the elders? Oh, wow. Yeah, wow. School's so exciting. Are you kidding? Spyro's going to learn some sweet tricks. Like what? Magic. You know, transmogrification, presentation, levitation, you name it. What? No way. Cool. I want to learn how to... Prist prist er levitate. The other's magic is really powerful. In fact, well, just be careful. Sounds like the little bunny knows a lot about magic. Maybe I do. Sounds like the little bunny learned a few tricks from the sorceress back in the day. That's none of your business. All aboard. Bye, Spyro. See you next year. Bye. Don't do anything I wouldn't I, I wouldn't do. But watch out for those spooky elders. Ooh. Shut up, Hunter. Well, that's that for another season. So long, tourist. Here's your hat. What's your hurry? Arr! Don't be blue, Spiral. You'll see your pals again. How about a little coconut treat? So creamy, so rich, you can't resist. Ah ha ha! I knew you'd say yes. Be right back. Okay. While Spiral drifted off to sleep once again, ominous clouds appeared above the land. They crackled with magic, signaling the approaching threat. A deafening crack, a bolt of energy rushed towards Earth, right for Spyro. A wave of dark magic pulsed across the land, pushing everyone into a strange dimension known as the Shadow Realm. Oh god, is that a trilobite? Ow! Oh lord, what the heck is going on here? I don't know if we can defeat these enemies. Okay, I don't think we can, so... Oh, Thomas. Spyro! Spyro, it's Thomas. I'm speaking to you telepathically. Listen carefully. I can help you, but you must do what I say. First, your attacks are useless against these creatures. You must run from them. Make your way to the portal outside Dragon Village. It will bring you to the dojo. Huh? Understand? What the? Find the portal. It's somewhere northwest of you. Oh, I'm assuming that's what be was behind that giant door. These creatures are weird as F nuggets, man. 
Did I go the right way? Quickly, Sparrow, I need your help. I was working on my house when it happened. Now I'm trapped. I'm northwest of you. Use your flame breath to remove the, this beam that's on me. It's okay, it won't hurt me. North what? Oh, that beam, okay. Burn, beam, burn! You okay, dude? Nice work. Your breath is pretty handy. Too bad I lost my flame powers long ago. Now let's go to the temple where we'll be safe. Follow me. Oh, we actually have to follow. Okay, I would like to grab whatever's up here, though. Oh, it's just some gems. Okay, cool. Hey, was that Bentley? I don't- I- this game will be cool if it has Bentley in it. I love Bentley. We should be safe here. Are you alright? The other elders are still trapped. I'm going to get them. Don't argue. Wait here. Blast it! I couldn't help them. I thought I could, but- Okay, Sparrow, listen closely. We don't have much time. Someone has cast a spell on Dragon Realms. The Dragon Elders are trapped and they cannot get out. I thought I would be able to help them escape, but I am too weak. The attack, the calamity, is affecting me too. Spyro, you have to go back in there and free the Elders. Your magical energy is strong. There is no one else who can do this. There is a dangerous thing I am asking you to do. Those monsters could have destroyed you before. That's why I'm going to give you something to protect yourself with. Normally, I would never give this to an untrained dragon. But this is the desperate situation. This is the Shadow Stone. Ooh, that's pretty cool. It's an Elder's Amulet, you see. Much like the one I'm wearing. This is a powerful huh? tool. It will sharpen and focus your magic. Hmm. Oh yes, there is much magic in you. Now quickly, we haven't got much time. This is a dimension portal. They are old and haven't been used for many of thousands of years, but they are like located all over the world. It will allow you to pass between our world and the Shadow Realm. Stand on it and use the amulet. Oh, that's what they are. They're, they're portals. Okay. Now press the X button. Phase. You did it! Notice you can't see me in the Shadow Realm. That's because I'm still in the real world. In fact, I cannot see you either, but I can sense you by using my magic. While you are in the Shadow Realm, your fire breath will have no effect. Nor can you open doors or chests. However, you will find that you can walk through some doors as well as other solid objects. When you are ready, stand on the portal and press the X button to return to the real world. Now let's investigate. Hmm... I don't think we're actually meant to do anything in here. I think we're seriously just meant to, uh... I guess touch that. Very good, Spyro. Now listen, the first person you must save is Ragnar. But you mustn't call him by his real name. He hates that. You must call him Sensei. Of course, you haven't heard of him. He wants to be left alone. He is very private and very old. Also, he is very cranky, but that cannot be helped. He will help you free the other dragons. You can find his house on the other side of the dragon cave. The cave entrance is due north of the temple, where we are now. So, I'm assuming that's all we're going to do this episode. So, let's actually, let's gather some gems and find out what this... Uh, some more gems. Ooh, lots of gems in that one. Holy cow. Anyways, in the next episode, we will continue on with the dragon, uh, with our quest to go to the dragon cave. See you guys next time.